person, and then we'll go from there. So, um, let's see, where should I start? Let's start, we'll start here. So this is Kelvin. Hi. He actually grew up in Augusta. Right. And uh, he's Nancy's brother-in-law, and he's married to Tiffany. And I oh, there she is. That's Tiffany. So, um, you introduce Tiffany. Tiffany's my older sister. We come from a family of five, so she's the first, and I'm the second. Right. Um, all right. This is David and Michelle. I met David. It's actually kind of interesting when I met him. I love this story. We both kind of, neither one wanted to tell what the other did. So we went back and forth describing our jobs without saying what we did. Until finally I realized he's a doctor and I said, hey, I'm a cardiologist. And Michelle then hit him and said, he got you. <laughs> and so um, he's, a, he's actually a pulmonologist. He lives in Dallas, Texas. And he used to go to fellowship when we were here. Um, this is their son, Ethan. Who, what Ethan's Ethan. what, three or four? Four. Ethan's four. Um, who? Let's see, so Ethan, Michelle. This is David. Uh, this is Jason. <laughs> Jason and I went to med school. He's from Rhode Island. He's a pathologist. He lives in uh, Tamarack. Do you still live in Tamarack? Yeah, he lives somewhere near there in Florida. Um, I don't know. He was homeless a few weeks ago. <laughs> this is Vikas. The, the story on Vikas is um, we kind of just kept, we went to med school together. He's an ophthalmologist. We kind of kept in touch. So when the snowstorm happened a few years ago, um, I, I had to go to the one person I knew to go to. So I was stuck at home. I sent him an email, I think, and he's like, yeah, you're describing iritis. And, he, and, and so then he talked me through it and told me what medicines I needed to be. And a few days later, when I ended up meeting Nancy, I was like, yeah, my friend said I need this medicine. And she's like, what? You have friends? <laughs> this is Crawford Loritz and Karen Loritz. I know you're from New Jersey. I'm guessing you're from Philadelphia, but am I right? Oh, good. They, um, so Sahar's family parents aren't here, but when Sahar comes, you guys love to travel and they love to travel. He likes baseball, she likes crafts. So those are things I've learned. Um, and uh, he's the pastor of our church, and, which is in Roswell, which everyone's invited to on Sunday. Uh, this is Michael Allen. Michael and I met when I got the bogus consult one day. <laughs> I was actually trying to get home early on a Saturday. But we ended up getting to know each other inside of work and outside of work. He's a psychiatrist, but he does locum. So he travels the whole world all the time. So I never, like, he's not even going back to Dallas tonight. <laughs> or Sunday or whenever. This is Leo and his wife Amanda. And as I've been reminding them, there she's about to have baby number four of seven. <laughs> this is the first girl, um, and his, so he has three sons. I met Leo at a leadership institute about four years ago, and and then I just got to know kind of Leo, and he's the guy that I went to, Leo and David and Michael actually, all three, and there's one other guy, were like the three who were holding me accountable so that I, my relationship with Nancy was appropriate. Um, so I'm gonna let Nancy start, but this is Chris. Yeah, so this is Chris and Jennifer. Jennifer's my sister, Chris is her husband. Um, I guess the interesting thing is that they travel all over and they rack up points and so they get all these free hotels and everything. Nice. So they're at the at our um, reception site. They have this like big suite up here. <laughs> and then um, there's Jessica and Justin. Jessica's my youngest sister, and Justin's her boyfriend. Um, they're from sunny Northern California, and. Um, <laughs> and this is my aunt. Um, she's my mom's sister, and she's from France. So she flew all the way here. So she speaks French, but not much English. And then there's my mom and dad. Um, they're from LA. They're originally from Vietnam, but they're Chinese, so it's kind of confusing that way. Um, my older sister, and then these are my two nieces, their daughter. Um, this, well, uh, Kristen and Laura, they're seven and five. <laughs> And then this is my youngest brother, Tommy, and his girlfriend, Jennifer. And they're both lawyers. Um, he's commercial, and she's education law, and they just took the bar, so I felt y'all's pain. <laughs> <laughs> the same way. 
Um, this is my cousin Alice. My mother has a ton of siblings, so this is her older sister's daughter who lives in South Carolina. And this is my cousin Belvin and her husband Galen, and they, like the Luritzes, they're, they live in New York, New Jersey. New Jersey. Um, yeah, and you'll hear the accent. <laughs> and this, their sons, Justin over there and Jason right there. And this is my cousin Fuzzy, who is my mother's older brother's daughter. And she also lives in uh, Hampton, or South Carolina. Um, that's my nephew Joel, and that's, he's six, by the way. Um, and that's my niece. Abigail or Abby, um, their parents are coming, but they're not, they haven't left yet. And then this is my mother, Hannah. Um, I don't need to say much more about her. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I think we got everyone. So the other thing about me and Nancy is that um, it's a tradition, and nobody has to participate, you won't be offended, and it's not a sin if you don't. But we chose to be followers of Jesus, which means, and one of the things that he always did was he would stop and say his uh, a prayer to God, who's his father, um, before he ate. So we're going to do that. And again, you don't have to participate, but um, if you want to, you can. So, Father, we pause to say thank you for the day and for what you're doing in our lives and for this weekend. And we stand before you grateful for the food. And we do ask and pray that you bless it. And we thank you for bringing people here safely and hope that they'll be able to safely return home. But we also pray that though we stand as a chain that's broken, one day we'll stand before you, every one of us, as an unbroken chain who worships and honors you. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. So, um, Jenny's, where's Jenny? Where's Jenny? So, I